In this video, we're going to build a beetle bot. This particular beetle bot is going to get Sally, our ping pong ball friend, out of an obstacle course. So beetle bots can be seen on websites like Instructables and Make. Uh, we're building this one again to rescue our friend Sally. Uh, so it's got two uh, glowing eyes and bottle caps for the eyes. Anyway, we're going to turn it on and you can see it bumps up against walls and moves out of the way. This robot doesn't require any programming at all. It's just a really simple uh, switch driven robot. Okay, so let's uh, see what we need to make it. So we need some solder, and that's going to connect, allow us to connect our wires. We need two pieces of shrink wrap tubing. We need uh, two 1.5 to 3 volt motors. And you can see we also need some bottle caps. Those are going to surround and create our eyes. We need a AA battery holder that holds two batteries, three large paper clips, some hot glue, two uh, sliding switches that can be single pole or double pole switches. Uh, and then we need some resistors. Uh, usually between 40 and 60 ohm work well. It depends on the LEDs you select. And then uh, we need two AA batteries and six covered spade connectors. Those are female spade connectors, and those are going to slide on our single pole double throw lever switches the, that are right here. And you can see those are lever switches there. And then we need some hookup wire. 22 gauge hookup wire works great. Um, we also need some uncovered spade connectors, uh, the female ones here. And then we uh, also need our LEDs, two LEDs. And so the tools that we're going to need are a, a wire stripper. We're going to need a wire cutter, which is uh, sort of a nipper pliers. And then we're going to need a needle nose pliers, a soldering iron, and a hot glue gun. In the next clip, we'll show you how to use all these parts and tools to build a spout bot. 